you have entered the Chronics rabbit hole. And Matt, thank you so much for your Patreon membership request. You are bringing back some Nightwish down the rabbit hole, but this is a new song for us. The song name is How's the Heart, and this is the acoustic version from Planet Rock. Thank you so much, Matt. I'm really looking forward to some new Nightwish coming down the rabbit hole. Thank you so much, Matt, for bringing a new Nightwish down the rabbit hole. I'm really looking forward to this acoustic version of How's the Heart. You did mention that this it, version of this song grew on you a lot when you heard it, as this is just floor and Troy. Troy. Yeah. So I'm really looking forward to seeing this acoustic version. We actually haven't heard the original How's the Heart, mm -hmm. so this will be our first introduction to this song. It is from the new Nightwish album as well. So if you guys are looking forward to this, remember to like, comment, and subscribe so you never miss a beat. I'm always so surprised when there's new Nightwish to come down the rabbit hole, and I'm really appreciative of that, and we want more. So thank you guys so much, Nightwish Army. Matt, we really appreciate this. Always exciting to see Floor sing in such a raw version here. All right. You good, hon? Yeah, I'm just making sure everything's fully plugged in. All right. Planet Rock. Planet Rock. What is Troy going to be that using? That was hype. That was very <laughs> hype. Oh. say something real quick because of how beautiful this is he's using the capo it, it's making it just sound so incredible on this acoustic guitar troy harmonizing with floor but not hearing floor for a while just forgetting how incredible she is and even though this is like a slower song tuama still has stretched her lyrical performance here yes. where she's even like adding these like -na 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 -na, how's the heart and then she like added that part where I, I was like whoa i love that part though. yeah how slow it is yeah Dude. Exactly, right? It's beautiful. And then she comes up. Yeah. And so it's like this spiral falling and the the way like she has mentioned that she loves being pushed mm -hmm. to get somewhere new, to do something new. Yeah. And this is this is it. Yeah. Because that takes so much control and power and precision and like I'm going to be honest, I'm loving hearing Troy right now because we don't really get to hear him sing. And yeah. he has an amazing voice. Absolutely, he does. And right? it fits really well with Floor. They fit so well together. They're yeah. beautifully harmonized. Um, the electric acoustic is phenomenal. Mm -hmm. I love this instrument, but I never realized how much I love the instrument because yeah. Yeah, you take it for granted. You do, actually. Hell you yeah. take it for granted. Yeah. And, um, and I, like, this is so intimate so intimate yes so intimate but yet you're getting everything that is nightwish in it all in like such an intimate little space yeah and we know nightwish started with just acoustic and some keyboard and singing so like this yeah. kind of reminds me of old school nightwish and this is beautiful we met where the cliff greets the sea shared a story took the lead 
Just incredible, and to know this is like probably without drums, the bass, and the keyboard, but it's just how powerful it still felt, and it made me want to listen to the studio version as well because that part when she like started belting it as well, yeah. like I feel like that's maybe when they bring in the other instruments to like add that next layer, or, but I don't know, so that's why it's just su super intriguing yes. and getting to see Troy and Floor, especially like you said, we don't get to hear Troy have that much intimacy with seeing to like see it that personally. Mm -hmm. Um, he's incredible, what a musician, and but like just hearing Floor's range again when you just don't see her for a little bit, and now we have her back on the channel again, and just having that. She's like as good as they get, really, honestly. She is. She's <laughs> phenomenal. Oh my god. She has so much range, so much control. Like I I I love her voice and her tone is actually beautiful. Yeah. It she is. has such amazing tone. And like the way that they were able to harmonize together in this moment was fantastic. This is also it is a very sad song yeah, in a way for sure. like and so like to be able to have that intimacy to be able to have such a sad song but also to how a uh, beat it is so gives, gives you encouragement it gives you encouragement it still gives you like that space to you know still be able to dance and move yeah because like they're asking how's the heart when you see a mother without a child. Yeah, that's like the first lyric, the right? The very first yeah, lyric. Yeah, exactly. And like that one instantly caught me and I was like, wait mm -hmm. a second. Like, this is what this is about? This oh, is what this okay. is like, how's the heart? Yeah. It's like, how's the heart when it's still beating when there's a mother without a child? How's the heart when it's still beating but there's a John Doe that we don't know? Yeah. How's the heart when it's still beating when someone's drowning in the mire? It, we, right? we ask it's, too often after it's like yeah well, how did he pass why don't you ask how his heart is before he passes and make sure you're there for the people when they're going through all these day-to-day -day yeah. moments right and it's like because we always ask like how you doing but nobody actually and i i'm just gonna say it nobody cares 
how people are doing. No one is actually asking. It's like, hey, how's your day? How's it going? And you're like, oh, well, mm -hmm. it's great. Yeah, it's everything's okay. fine. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah. But no, but then if you say like, hey, how's it going? Someone's like, you know what? I'm actually not okay right now. People are like, oh, but like, I didn't actually want to. But even the correct, like saying the correct thing, being specific and yeah. instead of how you doing, how's the heart? How's Might be the, the best heart? way to ask someone actually how they're actually doing when, when you, you mean it that way. When you way. mean it and you want to know, you want to yeah, care. Yeah, because how you doing really can mean anything. Like, mm -hmm. hope you're well. It's like, well, yeah, I'm not. Like, do you want to know? But it's like, how's your heart? That's so specific yeah. on how you're, how are your emotions dealing right now? Because going to that person, so going to the person who lost the child, the mother without the child, mm -hmm. going to her and being like, hey, how are you doing? She's always going to tell you she's yeah, fine. I'm fine. How's your day? How are you handling it? Yeah, it's all right. I'm, I'm handling it as well as I can. I'm fine. Yeah. Right? But if you say, how's your heart? That would hit so differently. That hits so differently. Yeah. And then, like, even then, like, if you're asking the person before, how's the heart? And then after, how's the heart? You're going to get two different answers. You're yeah. going to get two very different experiences. Whether you're asking the person drowning in the mire, are you asking the person before he drowned, or are you asking the family after? Yeah. And everyone yeah. waits till it's too late to ask each other how they're doing no kidding, and right? what's going on. Yeah. And so, like such a powerful song and then also with the range that uh floor is being pushed at yeah. it's like, so incredible it's oh, just man. like it's amazing because then also she's going like her solo career so you and this song was a big example where i think she's pushing her solo career as well yeah. for the style of songs that she's doing but then also getting me amped up for the next album where it's going to be even heavier big because mm -hmm. also matt you said this grew on you more with the the, this live version so maybe this version that was even nicer to bring out that rawness maybe some of the other instruments not necessarily took away from it but maybe it needed to be a, a troy and floor little raw type of thing like yeah. this to really get the full experience out but i've never heard of a saying that hits way better than just how you doing like yeah. how's the heart i'm gonna use that and take that i think everyone should do that. everyone should take this and i think i, I think it takes someone like tuamis to bring out a saying like this yeah, oh yeah he's because this is going to be very different in every language yeah and yeah, and, yeah, yeah. and this could be a common saying in some languages within no translation yeah, yeah yeah but for english this is not a very common saying this is not something that you would regularly no. ask someone especially not in north america but like to ask specifically how is your heart doing and like this very intimate moment with just Floor and and Troy, this is making me want to seek out more of these intimate moments of songs. Yeah. Because it's also nice for me, because I really like knowing the lyrics. I like being able to hear, like, the story that's going through. Yeah. So this is a really unique way to get introduced to a song that you haven't heard before when this isn't the entirety of the song. Yeah, absolutely. So now when we are going to hear How's the Heart as its full version, yeah. not just this intimate version. Whether in a concert or from the actual studio version we're itself. We're going to understand its meaning and be able to reflect on it so much more once we have all these other instruments mm -hmm. because of this intimacy that we've been introduced to it to. Yeah, we got to hone in on the real message here. And again, mm -hmm. like that is the best way to ask. Don't ask how are things. Ask specific. So I hope you guys specifically liked this video and you can let us know by hitting that like button comment down below what you took out of this amazing performance and if you want to see more nightwish you should probably hit that subscribe button because there will be more coming down the rabbit hole but we are exiting the rabbit hole now folks that was awesome to get back to human nature thank you so much matt thank you so much matt this was amazing peace and love everyone god bless y'all take care and bye for now don't forget to like comment and subscribe for more enter the chronicness Special thanks to all of our YouTube, Patreon, and Buy Me A Coffee members. Thank you for all of your support.